my. Okay. Hey guys. <laughs> I don't even know how to help this. Um, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a wig review. This one was not sent for review. And this one I purchased with my own money. Um, I was sucked into one of those Facebook or Instagram, I don't remember what, ads because I review hair toppers and I'm often looking up wig reviews, wig websites and things like that. Um, I have a lot of targeted ads towards wigs and some of them look too good to be true. So I decided, hey, they're super cheap. Why not try them out and review them for you guys and let you know if they're the real deal or not? So <laughs> that's what I did. Before I tell you what this is, let me just show you a picture right here of what this is supposed to look like. So you're seeing that now. Let's compare. Not the same. <laughs> I have no words. Not that I expected it to be the same, um, but these videos were literally like girls putting the like putting the wig cap on, flipping their hair up, moving this part around. This part in the video was basically like lace, like see-through, so that you could see your own part through it. Um, it just looked so amazing in the video. Even on the website, I'm showing you the stock photo. If I can, I'll put the video in as well. Um, it, it looks awesome. It looks like a, definitely a wig I would love to have in my life. But when you look at the price, it is $49.88 US. And you're like, that's a little bit too good to be true. Even with synthetic hair, I'm kind of getting more used to wig and topper prices and I'm like, mm, not so sure about that. So want to try it out for myself. So this one here is called Blonde Wig Slay, exclamation mark. <laughs> That's what she's called. Uh, I got it in 120% thick. There was the 100% was normal and then there's also 140% which was extra thick. Um, but I went with the 120% which I would agree with. I do think this is 120% volume wise for hair. Let's see what else it has on the website. Besides that, I mean, it just shows you the same girl with pictures. Um, there's a video. Oh, here we go, about the product. It's telling you which density to choose. We provide high quality product with a natural color and good texture, 100% breathable net within the network, make you feel comfortable when you wear it. And adjustable straps, length as picture, ombre two-tone, black roots to blonde, kind reminder, so I see I didn't I didn't read this slightly color difference between different monitors so they're trying to tell me that it's the monitor that's showing up different coloring the length is 22.5 inches and that's pretty much all it says on the website okay so this wig here I mean it is 22.5 inches uh, I would agree with that the main issue is this top color here okay I don't know how true it's showing in camera, but here in camera, it's like a black blue with a hint of green to it. So let's get up and close and personal here. Well, as you can see, it looks super fake right from the get go, but that is the color up close. In the picture, she just has very subtle, like brown roots right there to this gorgeous shade of blonde. This shade of blonde is not the same shade of blonde if the roots were a different shade, not bluey green. Uh, I might be able to cope with this. I mean, it's very wig-like. It's shiny. It's $44. So what can you really expect from it? I wasn't expecting exactly the picture. Don't get me wrong. Um, but I'm just surprised. I'm surprised that this is, this is what arrived. I'm sure there's a lot of disappointed people out there. Let's, let's just take this off so you can see up close. <sighs> okay. So. I mean the curls are nice in the in the photo there it's more of a wave but I'm sure these these are synthetic so I'm sure they die down oh my okay <laughs> I'm not gonna do that anymore that's a lot of shedding a lot of shedding it's actually the first time I've tried it on because it came in the mail and I was like oh my that is that is not what the photo showed so we're not gonna comb our fingers through it because it sheds a ton Here's that weird greeny blue black color. And then here's the top here, which the part just kind of looks white. Okay, not the end of the world, but the reason I wanted to try it is because in these videos, it showed like a really natural, natural part that you could move around. I was so excited about the part. And this is definitely, definitely not the part. Even the cap itself comes right to the edge of the part. So, so you can see it when you're wearing it there. Here's the cap here. 
Uh, it definitely was hot on the head. It does have a little bit of stretch. It's adjustable down here at the bottom, but there are no clips, no combs, nothing to secure this to your head at all. It's just a cap. So it would, someone could literally just yank it off my head because there's nowhere, there's no way to secure it. I'm trying to double check and make sure. Nope, the hair does not feel soft. But again, you guys, $44, I had to try it out. I wanted, I wanted to know for myself. Maybe some of you guys were curious as well. Um, the website, oh, I should tell you the website. Okay, the, the website is variouscales1.com. I, should I link it down below? Yeah, why not? I'll link it down below in case you were thinking of buying from a similar similar company on Facebook. Um, I feel like green, G-R-E-E-N-E, -E -E, that's another one I've been seeing with the same similar photos. I don't know if they're the same company or not, but I do keep wanting to try these things out. I don't know why. I just, I feel like for such a cheap price, it's worth knowing. So if you want to see me Try out these ads that you're seeing on Facebook and Instagram, if you are seeing them, like if you're into hair like I am, then I'm sure you are. Let me know, send me links to ones that you want me to try out, because I'm definitely willing to spend my own money and try them out for you guys, just to kind of investigate how real these videos really are. So, that color though, oh my, oh my. I wish you could see like the blue green tint to it so is it a terrible wig no I mean it's still a wig it's still held together it it's still a wig it is a wig I keep repeating that it's a wig is it a wig I would wear no is it a wig I would recommend no is it a wig that looked like anything like in the photos no so at least I only spent $44 on it um, it's shedding seriously all over me I hope you guys found that somewhat I don't know insightful entertaining if anything um, and yeah if I find any good any Further ads that look good to me, I will definitely check them out if they're like the cheaper ones because some of these prices are definitely too good to be true. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Let me know if you have any questions and thank you so much for watching. Bye!